One of the many new features we've added to Conduit 2 is loadouts. Loadouts consist of all of the gear you bring with you when you start a game. You can check your loadouts almost anywhere in the front end of the game by pressing the minus button to bring up the profile screen. The profile screen gives you quick access to lots of information about your Conduit 2 persona. You can see your file name and rank, how much XP you need to get to the next level, the credits you have available for shopping in the store, your loadouts, and your achievement score. In Conduit 2, you have four loadouts that you can fully customize. Each loadout is linked to a different customized multiplayer avatar. Each loadout consists of a primary weapon, secondary weapon, grenade type, and four unique suit upgrades. If you click on a category, you can swap out equipment for that slot. If you're getting tired of what you have unlocked, you can press the plus button and immediately jump to the in-game store and shop for something new. Just like the profile, the store is accessible from nearly every screen in the game's front end menus. Once you've bought something new, it's unlocked for the rest of the game and you are free to use it in any of your loadouts. Just press minus to jump back to the profile screen and equip the new gear. Not only can you use your loadouts in split screen and online multiplayer, but you can also use them in the single player campaign. With 21 different weapons and 30 suit upgrades to choose from, there are plenty of combinations to try out. You'll notice some obvious builds as you start unlocking new gear, but there's tons of crazy, less predictable combinations that are quite powerful as well. If you like sniping, you can work on unlocking the phase rifle specialization build. Start with the phase rifle as your primary weapon, and then take something more suitable for close quarters as your secondary. The phase rifle is already powerful at getting headshot kills, but if you select the phase rifle specialization upgrade, you can pull off one-hit kills on any unarmored target. The phase rifle allows you to see and shoot a short distance through walls as well. If you want to maximize this potential, make sure you take phase rifle penetration with you as well. Finally, you can complete your ultimate sniper build by taking phase rifle tuning. Normally, targets are alerted when you are tuning in on them through walls with a phase rifle, giving them a chance to run away. But if you take this upgrade, they'll never know what hit them. You can stop the phase rifle's ability to tune in on you through walls by taking a stealth upgrade. This also stops you from showing up on enemy's radar. The invisibility granted by the ARC Eclipse makes it a strong combination with stealth. You can complete your stealth build with an office favorite, Blinding Powder. Inspired by the ending of Bloodsport, Blinding Powder very briefly blinds opponents when you attack with melee. This maximizes the disorientation you cause enemies when you decloak next to them and start swinging. Another fun combination is pairing the Aegis device with radiation grenades. The Aegis device can catch enemy bullets and allow you to shoot them back at their source. But one thing it doesn't block is punches in the face. As a result, once you've started catching bullets, you'll often see enemies charge in for a melee. But if you've got a rad grenade ready to stick to their face, you can catch them off guard. After they're stuck, run off to safety and wait for the kill skull. One last combo that's fun to use is the Dark Star with Armory. The Dark Star can unleash a devastating black hole, but only if you get one or more kills against targets that you've tagged with its regular shots. Since the regular shot doesn't do that much damage, this often means switching to your secondary weapon after you've tagged someone to finish the job. But if you pick Armory as your primary upgrade, you can bring two heavy weapons into the fray. Now that you've tagged someone with the Dark Star, you can switch to another powerful weapon to help pave the way to your black hole destruction. There are so many unique weapons and upgrades in Conduit 2 that the loadout system really keeps gameplay fresh.